Hello everybody, welcome back to Watch Life. I think this is episode 14. I'm in a really good mood and the reason for that is I've literally done a full clean, I say clean, I've tidied my apartment so I'm feeling better. Also, I've had to move my sofa to there because this is now like the filming spot. So, I need to pick up a Tiffany Blue Oyster Perpetual today. Um, 41 mil. I will uh, be able to offer it for a very, very good price because backpack dealer. If you don't know what a backpack dealer is, it's when you you know you you you're a dealer and you wear a backpack. No, it's it's when you basically don't have a brick and mortar. You don't have a store, so you just like on the road all the time. I don't have an office. This is my office and my film studio. So, oh boy, what am I saying? I'm gonna go get the train. Okay. So I'm going to Chichester, Chai, Chichester, Chichester, and uh, yeah, I think I'm on the right. Okay, so I've just got into Chichester. Never ever been anywhere near this part of the UK in my life. Um, so the guy that is selling the Tiffany Blue OP, he bought the watch last week, okay? Um, and he's chosen to sell it to me. It's interesting, so a lot of people recently have been commenting saying that, oh, you're a flipper, you're, you know, you're ruining the watch industry, all, all this kind of stuff. I'm like, no, I'm, I'm buying watches that people are choosing to sell and I'm selling watches that people want to buy. Yes, I make my cut and I make a little bit of money because I'm the middleman, I'm, I'm in between the buyer and the seller. I wish I was a flipper. <laughs> Look, I wish I had five, 10 AD relationships across the UK. And this is the thing as well, I may make 500 pounds on a, on a, you know, selling a watch. Someone who flips, they'll make 5K, 10K. <laughs> so like, I, I, I wish I was a flipper. Who cares anyway? Like people want to sell a watch, people want to buy a watch. Who cares? Right, 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 right. I am back home briefly because I don't want to be carrying around uh, this Rolex box. So I'm gonna, just gonna quickly show you what I picked up. I know you know what it is, guys, but I'm gonna show you anyway. 41 mil, Tiffany Blue OP. It is the most popular uh, color of the dials, of the exotic dials of the four in 41 mil, five if you include the 36 with the candy pink. There it is, absolutely stunning watch. Full set, full links, box, papers, card, new card. It's a week old. If you want it, get in touch. But the thing is, guys, if you actually want to buy watches from me, your best bet is to follow me on Instagram because that's where I put my watches up for sale first. Like, I might get a watch on Monday and then the, the video goes live on a Sunday and someone's already bought it. So if you wanna, if you wanna, you know, check out my latest watches, follow me on Instagram, Phil Reed X, uh, and then we can chat on there. But I also have something else that has come in the post recently. So you'll know Kareem if you've watched my other videos, which you should have done. But Kareem has bought three watches off me recently. And as I guess, like a little thank you, I mean, it's nothing much. Kareem has a little baby girl. And I thought I'm gonna get something for, um, yeah, for his daughter. Just a little book, it's, it's like a kiddie book. It's like, you know, D is for Daytona, C is for Cartier, R is for Rolex. So. Bedtime storybook. So I'm gonna give this to him later. Um, but right now, I need to go to Hatton G, Hatton Gardens. So yes, I need to go to Hatton Gardens. The reason why is because I need to get myself a White Dell Daytona, a 116500. Um, yeah, I have a, a client who has asked for it. So I'm gonna see if I can get a good deal and I think Hatton Gardens will be a good place to, to haggle, to negotiate for that watch. So. You're coming with me, you know you are. Let me get my bag ready, get my bag together. Obviously, I'll be wearing my Casio. Yeah, all right, I will see you in Hatton Gardens. Okay, Hatton Garden, I am here. Um, if you don't know what Hatton Garden is or where it is, um, Hatton Garden is basically a street in central London that has hundreds of jewelry stores, so watches and other uh, fine luxury jewelry, um, and it's pretty much near Chancery Lane, Tube Station and Hoban. So very central. Um, and yeah, like I said, it's just full of basically watch stores um, and a bunch of jewelers. Now the thing is as well, like 
as a dealer, like, I wouldn't know where to start really. I mean, <laughs> because there's so much and so much choice, especially like if you wanted to buy something like, yeah, it looks good that there's so many options, but like, where do you start? So many places here, like, yeah, ridiculous, but I don't know. I do know one person that is here and I'm gonna meet him in like five minutes. Uh, and I think he might be able to help me with a Panda Daytona and maybe introduce me to some other dealers, but like, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's, it's kind of intimidating just because, well, I don't really know anyone here, but like as a new dealer, I'm looking at this like, where do I start? <laughs> but anyway, we move. I'm gonna message this guy anyway. Okay, just checked the first place. They do not have what I'm looking for, so. Moving on to the next place. I did ask where they recommend I should go, like some of the dealers down there, but I'm pretty much just gonna have to go into every bloody place, aren't I? Wide our Daytonas are so difficult to get hold of and even more difficult to get at a good price. So, did see a bunch of black dial, but I'll carry on. <coughs> Ooh, push. So, the power of YouTube has really kicked in right now. So, I was, as you know, just sat, well, I was sat on a bench over there and um, uh, a dealer based in Hatton recognized me, hey mate, <laughs> recognized me and said, um, oh, uh, do you want to pop over? He messaged me on Instagram. So I was like, oh yeah, and we, we'd spoken before basically on Instagram. But he just was like, yeah, do you want to come up? So I literally just sat there for two hours. And then at the end of the conversation, I was like, I'm actually here to looking for a Panda Daytona. Do you have one? And he was like, yeah, I do. Do you want it? He said a price and I was like, yeah, deal. That easy. Like I say that easy, but like that quick. I f that, was, that was really lucky. But yeah, lovely guy. Really happy we could do business. So yeah, that's an example of when things go really well. So I am uh, yeah happy about that. Right, this is the third time I've been here today. So, yeah, I got the Panda Daytona, got a pretty good price on it. Um, so the client that wants the Panda Daytona is gonna do a, uh, like a part exchange with me and then put some cash on top. So I'm gonna have two new watches in stock. Uh, I'll let you know what those watches are very soon, no doubt. But yeah, I mean, I'm back home. I need to go meet Kareem in no battery. I need to meet him in like 10 minutes. I'm gonna go to the Sky Lounge. I need to give uh, the gift um, and then, yeah, crack on with the week. I mean, if anyone's wondering what, you know, what the life is like of a, you know, up and coming dealer, backpack dealer, if you wanna call it that, this is pretty much it. You know, spend a lot of time on the road, you know, getting tubes around London, you know, buying, well, trying to find watches, buying watches, and then obviously, obviously selling them. Uh, and, I, and I do that at the moment through uh, my social media, through YouTube and Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, like I said, give me a follow. Let's chat on there, easiest way. All right, time to deliver this little gift. I am in the beautiful Malta on vacation, but I do need to take this opportunity to thank the sponsor of today's video, Beth. Let me explain. So Beth is a state-of-the-art AI-based horse racing prediction tool. So basically, if you wanna make money and you're not sure how, you don't wanna invest a lot of time, Beth is your answer. So basically, the algorithm within the software of Beth is super, super intelligent. It will look at horse pedigree, it will look at the history of the performance of the horse, it will look at weather conditions, track conditions, it will include absolutely everything and it will give you the best prediction to be successful. It will literally tell you who you should basically put your money on. The thing is, it's never been so easy to bet on horses and make a lot of profit. You can make up to 150% profit per month. Beth pretty much does all the work for you, so like, you don't even really need to give much thought to it. And I know what you're thinking, you probably have your doubts, you're probably thinking, oh, can I trust this? Well, you can have a free trial for a whole week. You can test it yourself and you can see how well it does. But that is not all. Once you are convinced, you can use the discount code FILL35 and you can get that on the basic or the pro version. What I'm saying is like, you can make a bunch of money and you don't have to do much work. Like you, bas you, you pretty much don't do anything because Beth does it for you. All right, anyway, I'm gonna enjoy this view for a little bit more and then I'll be back to the grind. Well, I am back from Malta, a much needed few days off, <clears throat> didn't really do much. Um, and I have since oh, sold the Tiffany Blue OP. 
So, case in point, like at the start of the video, I did say, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you might not get a chance to actually, you know, put an offer in for the watch. This has sold as I've been filming throughout the week. So, yeah, it's no longer available, unfortunately. But I do have, I do have one other watch that is available if you're interested in a Wimbledon Datejust you can have it if you want it so I am advertising this watch at £8,350 it is the 41mm Oyster Bracelet and Smooth Bezel um, 8350 get in touch uh, it is 2020 however not that it makes much of a difference it was uh, yeah, 21st of December 2020, so almost 2021. Whenever someone buys a watch like late December, I'm just like, oh, just wait, just wait. However, it's uh, up for sale. Let me know if you're interested and we can uh, talk about price. Right now, I do need to go and drop off the Tiffany OP. Uh, so actually, another dealer has bought the OP and you know them pretty well if you watch my channel often. Um, it is DGH Jewelers, Dennis, he's a good chap. So, yeah, this is now his. Also, I probably don't seem too enthusiastic, and there is a reason for that right now. I don't feel 100%. I don't feel that good. Uh, I did take one of the, you know, the rapid antigen COVID tests this morning, and guess what, ladies and gents? Phil Reed does not have COVID, which is good news. I don't have COVID, um, but yeah, I still don't feel, don't feel, Bloody hell. I don't feel fantastic. So, you know, I'm just... I'm not, actually, I think you can see Dennis's office. So Dennis has recently moved into One Canada Square, I think. It, one Canada? Something in One Canada. I don't know what it is, but it's basically... So it's the building with the pyramid. Yeah. He's somewhere up there. Very nice. So, yeah, I'm now inside. Let's go check out their new place. Gloucester. One of the watches was a GMT root beer, which I'm now dropping off. 